Dick T. Bartolo, Maz Metis writer, and the Gizwiz with another One Take Theater here on Twit and also on the Hudson River. What you're looking at here is the Vavood. Yeah, weird. V A A V U D. And it's the smartphone wind meter. And we're on the Hudson, we're not moving. So why is this going at 3.9 miles an hour? Because we're using a marine fan, as you can see over there. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is one of my biggest fans. Um, so this little guy is pretty nifty. It works with uh, almost all the iOS devices, and it works with a limited amount of, I'm going to pull it out of the phone, um, Android uh, uh, devices. It works with the Galaxy S3 and the Galaxy S4. This is the S4. It also works with the S2, and there's a tiny little uh, adapter in the box. Now, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to hold this up again. And there we go. Now I can tell you that that fan is turning at 3.5 miles an hour. And it just stopped, okay. So this is how it works. Two little magnets in here. So when you stick it in, your, in the headphone jack, there's no physical connection. This is just a way to conveniently carry it. You can actually get wind readings just by holding this. And out on the water, I had Dennis on the front deck holding it. He took off. It was amazing. Uh, you never saw a more surprised Channel 7 helicopter pilot in your life. But I'm a good boater. Did a three, a, a quick 180, fell right back on the boat again. Bro uh, broke both legs, but it's a show business. He's filming this anyway. Uh, <clears throat> this just went off. So what's neat about this is, let me get it up again, is that you can plot the speeds on a graph and then other people can access that graph and see the speeds. So if a friend of mine was boating up the Hudson, I could follow his track and see the different wind speeds on the Hudson. Not so much for boaters because we have, you know, we have electronic instruments like this here that'll give us the speed. But on, um, on the line, kite flyers, people who sail fish, people who wakeboard and want to know the wind speed, they like this a lot. And they like this a lot because when you listen to the weather forecast, the wind they're getting is from a weather station. Here, if you tune into your friends, you're getting the wind at the location that you may be going to. Uh, it's a little expensive. It ranges between $45 and $50. And this is what the box looks like and then it comes with a nice little carry case. Uh, it was a Kickstarter project and people liked it enough that they reached the, uh, their funding in uh, like three or four days. So that's it, Vavood, I just like saying that, the Vavood smartphone wind meter. And I don't know how many miles an hour I can talk at, uh, but no, it looks like I'm, Oh, okay, I can, I can talk in two miles an hour. Dick T. Bartolo, Mads, Mattis, Ryder, and the Gizwiz with another one-take theater here on Twit and on the Hudson River. Ahoy, mateys!